Oh, the PTSD I get just from seeing the loading screen. God, this game is probably the most known horror game of all time. But dang, if it isn't one of the most classic ones we've ever played. Donald, you ever play this game? Heck no, I only play good games. This game looks like it was destined to be a 2D image its whole life. I mean, look at the ad here. 120 for a week? What are you on? Especially if we're going to have to put our lives on the line. On top of it all, how are they going to have us watch animatronics in an empty building all night? They already got a security system with those roaming teddy bears. It's not about that, it's about the nostalgia we get from playing it. Being demonologist was having frame drops. This is the next best thing, trust. Why do I have to control it? I don't even remember how to play this game, so I'm probably gonna die on the first night. Can you give me some pointers, Obama? Conserve power because for some reason you have limited power in this bitch, but have walking animatronics. Kind of wild if you ask me. Anyway, just don't shut the doors unless they're in the hallway and make sure to keep up with them. Otherwise, they're going to shank your ass and stuff you into a suit like one of them. Would be a lot easier if we just had a Glock in this bitch. They come down the hallway and just blind fire that shit like you're peeking a corner in Siege. It's not that hard. These things look so creepy and what's scary is kids actually enjoy eating here and hanging out with these things. Kids enjoy hanging out with you, it's mainly just the principle of it, so it's really not that odd if you ask me. Listen to this guy trying to play it off, like he isn't causing your death. Dude's acting guilty already. I mean, he's talking about how the company isn't responsible for any harm or death that comes from working there. Yeah, but that's not gonna hold up in court. Joe, stop checking the lights, nothing is there. Joe, you left that light on, turn it off, conserve power like Obama said. You're not the one playing this game, man, it's scary. What if there's a boogeyman or IT in there or something? You don't know, and when I check, you do. IT? You mean it? Yeah, that's what the kids called him in the movies, man. You are lacking in your horror knowledge, but sure are good at playing yourself to assume that the worst is happening. Yeah, Donald is right. All horror games are just mental. Nothing is actually going to happen to you, and you just got to be prepared for a jump scare. Then you're basically invincible and can complete the objectives and such. Easy to say when you're not the one at the helm. These animatronics aren't even moving. Why aren't they moving, Obama? I thought they were supposed to move. Are we sure they're not just decoys or something? Shut up, Joe, you're missing lore. Did you hear the bite of 87? That's when a kid got snapped on when the animatronics were allowed to walk around during the day. Now they're just confined and have to only walk around at night. Pretty deep stuff if you look into it on YouTube. Hyperdroid or Game Theory did a pretty solid job at covering it. You guys should watch it. I love lore, man, especially when it comes to Minecraft lore. That shit is like a Netflix documentary or the lore with zombies. Oh, man, that is a movie. I love the COD Zombies Easter egg storyline. It really was made insanely well. Did you watch that too, Joe? Heck yeah, maybe we should run some Origins sometime or something like that. Heck, I'd be down to run through all the Easter eggs again just for the heck of it. Throwback, boys. They don't move Joe until this dude finishes his phone call. Unlike you, they're respectful when it comes to other people doing stuff. They're going to wait for you to finish, then try to clap your ass and stuff you in a suit. Are we going to split the 123 ways or just give it to Joe? Feel like we should split it, being we're all contributing and we're just like a council that Joe can talk to if he needs help. Yeah, a billionaire needs like 40 bucks. Come on, man, you don't need that cash. And on top of that, you wouldn't report it to the IRS anyway. You just pocket it and not pay taxes on it. Can y'all bitches shut up? I'm pocketing it because I need the money more than you guys. The presidency pays well, but Jill takes a majority of it and only gives me like $10 a week allowance. I need all of it. Want to buy a new Lego set? Greedy as hell, man. You're not even going to split the dough. Then why are we here? We're not getting paid for it anyway. We don't get the money. It's a fake ad. It's fake. Are you guys trolling me? It's fake. It's fake, then. What are we doing here? Was there any reason at all to even play this game? I thought we caught a bag while playing it, but turns out it's just lies. Stop talking about the money. You're playing it because it's fun. Now, these fuckers are going to start moving soon, so you need to be ready, Joe. Start looking at cameras and make sure there are none in the hallway. Looks like none of them are moving. What's the one behind the curtain, by the way? Is there even one back there, or is it just an area that they don't want people to enter? That's Roxy. She'll come out, I think, on night two if we make it that far. She's more aggressive, kind of like a poltergeist and demonologist, except she charges you and runs down the hall. Hence, I'm saying we get a Glock. We get a Glock and nothing gets through that door. Or we could just get a double barrel. I don't know. Either works for me. 
Just make sure these bitches don't get us. Your odd obsession with guns is starting to worry me. I get you roll with the NRA, but you need to be reported to the FBI. You get where I'm coming from, right, Obama? No, I get where Donald is coming from. Stay strapped or get capped, but with animatronics. What the heck is that, bro? There's stuff on the screen, Obama. What is that? Oh, crap. That's Freddy trying to mess with your mind. You're good. I'm more worried about the singing that's coming from down the hallway. Wouldn't be no singing if we had a Glock. That's not an option in this game, Donald, so just drop it. We're at like 50% power, and it's only like 3 a.m. Are we doing good, Obama? Here, check the cams again. Yep, we're doing good. None of them have moved. What were the names again? Freddy is one I know, but what about the bunny and the chicken? One's called Bonnie, that's the bunny, and the chicken is Chica. All of whom are after your ass harder than the caregivers you have after you escape from your resting home. That's a good one. Keep checking cams, Joe. Oh, fuck, one of them is missing. The bunny is missing. Yep, go look for it. Oh, it's in the suit room. Well, shit, we've got some active ones tonight. Boys, prepare for an onslaught that's coming this underpaid guy's way. Oh, God, this is so scary. Look at it. Maybe it's by the door here. I'm checking lights. Oh, thank God. Oh, God, another one is missing. Yep, that chicken is hunting. Oh, fuck, that's terrifying. Wouldn't be so terrifying if we had, you know, any sort of defense. Turn that chicken into a Costco rotisserie one. Joe, just hold like you're at the Alamo. We only have like three more minutes of this shit and we're good. You're at 4 a.m. Believe and achieve. Oh, God, none of them are moving. I feel like Chica wants to chick me out and slice my ass up with a box cutter. God, man, someone else play this shit. I can't do it. Toughen up, my boy. I need you to stop crying and start looking at cameras. Focus on the ones that have the beasts in them. Donald's right. If you don't keep looking at them, then they're going to move and probably end up getting to you. You have to keep altering the camera and make sure that you have eyes on all three of them. Well, four in the case of Roxy. But I doubt you're going to get there being you don't remember this game. Need to hard focus and keep on edge. All right, I got this. You got this, Joe. Oh, God, I can't find the bunny. Where's Bonnie? Oh, Christ, I'm so chopped. I'm going to be on the 10 o'clock news. I'm so dead. Fuck. Okay, relax. You're good. You're fine. Oh, God, what was that? You're fine, Joe. She probably is just moving. Holy fuck. What the heck was that? At this point, I think they're just playing with their food. You're chopped, Joe. Surrender to them and go out like a man. Start swinging and make sure you don't go down without a fight. He already is close enough to being a bot, so I wouldn't doubt it would be an easy transition. Yeah, the vote stands. Give up, Joe. Go to the light. You're beat anyway. Screw you, Donald. I'm trying here. You know what? If I wasn't the only one with a solid PC, we wouldn't have problems. But no, you chose a Ryzen 9 over a solid GPU, so now look at you. Can't even run this shit without having your PC scream. Joe Bonnie is in that hallway. You saw her, right, Joe? Which one are you talking about? I can't seem to find it. Wait, is it? No. Where is it Obama call it out? I can't find her. Should I shut the doors? I should shut the doors. Oh shit, let me check the cams. Oh, there she is right beside me. Oh crap. Joe, you're fine, don't shit in your diaper. I'm sure your nurse is tired of changing it. You're fine, you got this. It's almost 6 a.m., just don't choke. Probably could leave the doors down so no one can get in. You should have enough power, I think. Then again, I'm not an electrical guy. Shut up, Donald, you don't know how to play this game. How do we play the game, Obama? Where do we go from here? I have eyes on all of them, and Bonnie is in the closet on cam three while Chica is just eyeing me down still. You fool, why are you going to leave the door open on the side Bonnie is on? You've doomed us all. And you check the tablet right after. Great, just great. Relax, none of them are moving. We're fine, Obama, just trying to conserve power. Honestly, you should just leave the door shut. That's probably best Then no one can kill you. You'll be fine. Just need you to lock this bitch down like you're working at a McDonald's. And Joe is trying to come through to get ice cream. Joe, shut the right door. Chica is there. Where's Bonnie? Do you have eyes on Bonnie? Joe, do you have eyes on Bonnie? Let me check. I don't see her anywhere. Oh, God, I'm going to remove the tablet and I'm beaten. Oh, God, I can't handle this shit, man. The pressure is almost too much. Obama. Holy shit, what? Holy fuck, holy fuck, holy fuck. Oh, my shit, what? Holy, it's Bonnie. I told you, I told you, Joe, you needed to focus on making sure you know where they all are. Yawn. Not that scary probably would be more fun if Joe was senior to the point he can't even listen to Obama's tips. Pretty sad if you ask me. Anyway, if you've made it this far in the video, like and subscribe so I know you guys want to see more of these videos. Donald's selling out again. Can we go back to Rocket League? Okay, this isn't Demonologist. I thought it was Friday Night Frights again. The heck is this recommendation, Joe? Trust me, Donald. This is a scary game. 
And if you would like to see more, don't forget to like and subscribe. Also, if you have suggestions for games to play on Friday Night Frights, feel free to join the Discord in the description. All right, let's get into the game. Is Obama in? Yeah, Joe, I'm reading this shit. It says, be quiet. She hears everything. Who is she? You can drop objects in this game. Oh, shit, there are bear traps in this game. Yep, and we have to hide under stuff to escape within five days. Otherwise, Granny will kill us and send us to a purgatory or something. I don't know, the lore is kind of iffy. Why did you turn the volume down? Come on, Joe, I was vibing to that shit. So Granny just kidnapped us and we're trying to escape? The heck man who would want to kidnap me? You never answered, Joe, who is Granny? An old bitch who tries to kill your ass. Now watch the lore. Oh shit, Slender Man, the eight pages vibes, we like it. That was a fucking bear or something. Did you guys hear that? Why are we walking outside in the middle of the night anyway? Oh shit, fallen tree. This soil is probably shit. Oh hell no. Cabin in the woods in the middle of nowhere. Yeah, nope. Fuck up out of there, Joe. It's a cutscene. I have no control. Bro, we're creeping on this house. Are we stalkers? Bro, why do we have to get so close? Run! The fuck was that? Ah! Uh, oh, Joe, Joe, I mean, run. fuck, I can't run, shit! Fight that bitch, Joe! Damn it, why didn't you put up a fight? You could have won, she's old anyway. I have no control over the character, Donald. Great, now we're fucking kidnapped. I didn't agree to be kidnapped, do I have to stay? Oh, Christ. Nah, just ask the crazy granny to leave. I bet she'll let you. Just gotta say please. Any more stupid questions, Obama? Shut up, we're waking up. Where the fuck is this place? Need some fresh paint. So our objective is to escape. Is there anything else we need to know, Joe? I don't think. Oh, look, a flashlight. This will help us in the long run when it comes to seeing shit. You don't think or you don't know? Pick up that vase. Maybe it has something. Nothing. Yeet. Oh shit, that made a lot of noise. Go look outside the door. Maybe there's something over there. Shit, she's coming. Joe, run. Run, Joe, run. Ah, I'm going to hide under the bed. Shit, shit. Holy shit, it's her. Hear me out, Joe. Vase on that bitch's head. Vase, whack head fall. Stand your ground. You got this. We can't. God, I'm so scared. What if she finds us? Relax, Joe. You got this. All we have to do is stay strong and we're good. Now, I assume we need to find tools to escape being we're picking up shit. That's just my judgment of it. So let's look around and stay away from that crazy granny. Stop hiding under the bed, Joe. You need to move. Nope. Nope. Doing fine right here. Oh shit, you're right. I'm not gonna die under a bed like a scared loser. That's the spirit, Joe. Now go back outside and see if you see anything. Listen to what Obama said and let's look for tools. I hear walking. I don't... Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, she's right there, guys. Holy shit, did you see that bitch? Holy shit! Run, Joe. Get back under the bed. Go to sleep. Sleepy Joe, live up to your name for Christ's sake. Joe, use the vase. Hit her on the head and run like you're Forrest from Forrest Gump. Holy shit, do you guys think she's a demon from the demonologist game? Do you think she's trying to kill us with her powers or something? I don't know, man, I'm scared. Someone else play. Nah, bro, this is your game. We're just helping your dog-ass self play it. Now go out there and fight this hoe. Yeah, Joe, if you stay under there for too long, I think you're going to get killed by the granny. God, this is so scary. Why did we have to get kidnapped instead of just not walking in the woods at night? Shouldn't have made a midnight ice cream run that led you to the middle of nowhere, Joe. Holy shit, there is blood everywhere. This crazy bitch is tripping on acid or something if she thinks she's getting Joe. Wait, did that board just creak? Shit, she's going to come stay hidden, Joe. Holy fucking shit, she's right there. Holy shit, what if she checks this cabinet? How does she not see the light? Nah, she ain't gonna check the cabinet. Maybe she's like a whale or something that uses echolocation. Bitch is probably blind from her youth of doing drugs or something. I mean, have you seen what she looks like? Joe, I think she is leaving the room. You should probably dip when you think it's safe. Don't want her to kill us. How do I know when it's safe? Do you see the crazy granny? No, I don't think. It's safe. Would be a lot more safe if you had that vase you could throw at this bitch, then run. Ah, oh, she's right there. She doesn't see you. What I see is those fucking locks on that door. Jesus, Trump Tower doesn't even have that much security. We ain't never getting out of here. Is she coming after me? Oh my god, I almost soiled my diaper. She didn't see you, I think you're good. Also, stop telling us you almost soiled your diaper shit is nasty. This locker will be our coffin. There is a reason there is air holes. We're never getting out of here. Try to be positive for one second impossible addition. Jesus, can you just have some faith in Joe for once in your life? 
I'll have faith when I'm the president again in 2024. I'm trying to work up the courage to get out. Fuck it, I'm going for it. You guys think she's gone. Oh shit, a bear trap. You're probably good. She probably went to take a nap. Ah. Have we? Holy shit, Joe. Run, run, Joe. Locker, locker, locker. What was that child scream? Haha. <laughs> yep, I soiled my diaper. Crap, I was really hoping I wouldn't have to get changed again. Stop talking about that shit, Joe. I find it weird that I have to ask twice. I find it highly normal. Sleepy Joe always wants to sleep on the questions given, so when he does get asked one, it's not uncommon to have to be repeated. I don't care. Roast me all you want. I'm staying in this cabinet until the day I die. I will never leave this cabinet. Joe, you gotta leave. Don't be a bitch. All right, fine. Shit, I'm scared, man. Start looking for parts like Obama asked. Watch out for the bear trap. I see that shit. Damn, this room probably smells musty as hell. Oh, look apart, a part of a shotgun. What do you guys think this is for? Gee, I don't know, probably for a shotgun. Holy shit, and you're the president. Yeah, Joe, that's, that was, wow. I'm going to stay under this bed until the granny dies. She probably doesn't have long anyway, otherwise they wouldn't have called her granny. Oh, great, we're watching the amazing race to death. Who will win, 80-year-old Joe or the granny who walks around swinging a bat? Yeah, Joe, you're screwed. What's that? Oh, it's an engine part. I don't think we need that. We need a key or something. I don't know. Damn it, we should have done the practice tutorial. Fuck this shotgun piece. Oh, shit, that made noise. Oh, God, she's going to come. Now's your chance, Joe, attack. Not all of us built like a D1 offensive lineman, big fella. We're going to wait this out. Hopefully she doesn't smell my diaper. Haven't changed that shit yet. Oh, my God, this is so scary. That bitch just said she saw you, Joe. No, she didn't. Otherwise, she would have gotten me. Joe, you need to get the freak out of there, man. Run to the roof. Find a way to the roof, and the Air Force will evacuate you or something. I don't know, but you need to make a move. I'm running. Almost. What the fuck is that? Holy shit, what the fuck? Don't worry, your life alert should be going off. You'll be fine, Joe. Oh shit, day two out of five. Maybe Granny will be less aggressive, or maybe she'll be more aggressive. I don't know, I'm not ready for this. Bro, trust me, she'll be more aggro. It's like you just poked a bear, and now that bear wants to kill your ass. Yeah, Joe, this is going to be really intense. Hopefully your old ass heart can take it. Holy shit, there's bear traps everywhere. Where is she? Oh shit, she's right there. Oh god. She doesn't see you, you're good. Just keep going, stop standing there. Well, shit, now she sees you. Run, Joe. Ah, uh, I don't want to be hit by the granny. Oh man, we're so cooked. She's gonna find me, isn't she? Keeping it a buck, I don't think she saw. How do you know Obama? Yeah, how do you know? I don't want to go out just to get whacked by this bitch again. Calm down, Joe. She would have attacked by now, but she hasn't. She's fast as shit and probably would be upstairs by now. Please don't listen to him, Joe. He's lying. He's trying to leave you out to dry as they did in Benghazi to those soldiers at the embassy. Stay hidden. I don't know who to trust, but I think he's right, Donald. She would have attacked by now. Your funeral, Godspeed, I guess. All right, Joe, let's keep exploring and looking to find parts. I guess our objective is to find a key to some of those locks on the door or something. Just keep looking around. I'm going back upstairs. I want to see that jail thing that she had. That's where she probably kept her victims. Don't go there, Joe. Start looking for stuff. I need a hammer to open this. Shit, where do I find a hammer? Wait, what is this thing? You made noise, Joe. You need to hide. She's coming upstairs right now to kill your ass. Shh, everyone be quiet. Don't want her to find us. We need to be ready to fight if she does. Jesus, Donald, your fat ass is breathing in the mic. Are you on a respirator or something? Sounds like Vader. Phew, that was close. She almost found us. Good thing she didn't, otherwise we would be in some shit right now. Actually, Obama, I'm breathing to stay alive. Get shit on. You have to breathe too, so shut up. I wonder what's down there. Do you guys think it will fall? Oh, shit. It's the other room we were in. Holy, we fell. Oh, God, she's going to get us. Stay hidden, Joe. No need to die because you forgot to hide. Don't fall asleep in the locker either. Oh, shit. Ah! Damn, Joe, you just got killed. I think she saw your ass get in the locker, so she just knew you were in there. Day three gamers, regain, regain. After being knocked out, I'm ready to get my revenge on this rat. She wants a fight. We're going to give her a fight. I like this way of thinking, Joe. Get the vase, send this bitch down like the Titanic. Straight to hell she goes. You can't just do that. You have to get parts and stuff to build stuff to get out or kill this bitch. Either works for me. Oh shit, I can't do this. I'm hiding behind the door. Maybe she won't see us behind here. Joe, next time, let me play because you're scared of everything. I'm not scared. Holy ah, uh, she's right. 
Damn, she is clapping your ass, Joe, do something. You just keep dying. If I wanted to watch someone get knocked out a bunch of times, I would have watched the WWE. Bro, she has walls or something because she knew I was there the whole time. That's why she went upstairs. She was going to kill me. Mission accomplished, no lie. She killed your ass and you're dead. Tragic, just so tragic. Well, technically, he's not dead, more like just knocked and woken back up. You got this, Joe. Just look for keys. Oh, shit, I made noise. God, I can't hide in this cabinet. Dang it. Run, Joe. She's going to find you. Oh, God, she's going to get your ass. You can't hide behind that, Joe. Find another hiding spot. Oh, God, you're so dead. Jesus, she's right there. Yep, you're dead. Joe, you need to find where she's at, otherwise you're going to walk right into her. Stop backseat gaming. Ah, holy shit, she's right there. Ah! <laughs> Told you, dumbass. Watching Joe play this is kind of depressing. It's like watching a toddler try to play college football. Just sad. Guys, I'm trying. We should have played the practice tutorial or something. This shit is so fucked. I don't know how to play this game. Why the fuck would you recommend it then? I mean, honestly, you can't expect to be good at every game just because you're somewhat decent at Rocket League. I sure as hell can. I'm always goaded. Goaded like the best player in the world, Turbo Pulsa. Well, maybe not at this game, but at Rocket League. Shut up, Donald. Joe, keep running around and see if you can find something like a key. <laughs> oh, shit. I just heard that bitch laugh. Keep looking. I can't find anything. There's no key anywhere. Just a bunch of stupid engine parts. What do I need an engine for? Am I going to suffocate this bitch with carbon monoxide? Joe, stop knocking shit over. She's just going to come up there every time you knock shit down, and as of now, you're trolling by hitting everything in sight. It's like you don't know how to walk. Oh, wait, that's true. This bitch really just asked if we wanted to play hide and seek. The heck, man, I thought we were already playing that shit. Oh, she's tossing shit. She's mad. She's mad we keep escaping. This is not good. Guys, this is not good. She's going to get us. We? More like you, bro. You're the one playing. Your ass gets knocked out every time. This ain't on me or Obama. Your ass is the one getting targeted. Good luck. Oh, shit. She's right there. Shh. We have to be quiet. I am not dying to this granny. Donald, you need to be more supportive. We're doing somewhat solid. You have one day left and you're walking around like you've just escaped from a resting home. There is no shot you're surviving this shit, man. You're chopped. Just accept that now. Probably should have done the practice tutorial or something, Joe. Take this as a lesson, I guess. The only lesson I see is to not play with you guys. All you guys do is degrade my ass for trying my heart out. This game is hard and y'all just need to realize I can't do this shit without help. Sounds like you can't do a lot of shit without help. You're kind of unable to walk as is, and I guess playing games can be added to the list now. Sheesh, falling off hard. Joe, just keep looking for a key. Maybe that's how we can escape, and then we're going to be fine. We're not choking like you did when you tried to say that one speech and ended up making some questionable remarks. Holy shit, there's no key. There's a bunch of bear traps. Shit, man, shit, I wonder where she is. Holy shit, holy shit. God, I'm just gonna, oh. I wonder what's going to happen now that you've died on day five. Will she finally just off you or let you go? Holy shit, Joe, she's right beside you. Oh God, don't remind me, I can't look. I'm closing my eyes. Oh shit, it's the jail that Joe tried to get to but died. She's gonna toss your ass in the hole, man. She's gonna kill you, <laughs> Joe. Oh, damn. Bro, she is about to toss your ass to the abyss. Shit, oh my god, she just bitch slapped you, Joe. Ha ha ha. Is it over yet? Is it over? Is it over? Please tell me it's over. Yes, Joe, the game is over. Now let's run the practice tutorial or something, please. I can't stand this shit where we just wander around not knowing what to do. Yeah, Joe, let's do it. We need to make sure we know how to play this time. What the heck is this game? Jesus, man, Joe. What are you trying to put us on, my god? What even is that? Looks like Joe, when he gets out the shower or goes to the beach, shirtless. Bro, is that man having a seizure? Looks like he might be wigging out. Could be a crackhead or something. This is a game made by a 13-year-old. I found it on a Markiplier video and thought we should play it because it looks scary as crap. I mean, just look at that thing. Bro does not look like he is living his best life. This best not be like the back rooms. I wonder if this is just like a purgatory or something that we're in. Is this real? Oh, so we don't know if it's real or not. We might be in a dream or something. We got lore, let's go. It can't be, I say, oh man, this is gonna be fun. Oh, I can't wait to play this one. I thought I woke up. What, we were asleep? 
When were we asleep? I don't remember going to sleep. That's Cap. I sleep only in my room. I don't sleep anywhere else, not trying to get robbed because I fell asleep in someone's room that isn't my own. Where the heck are we, Joe? Did we get put in a back rooms game? Like we're in a room and there is only one door. Even sounds like a back rooms level. What a trippy place. Nah, this is fucked. You see this crap? These hallways were about to get jump scared or something. Oh, this is not good. I do not like jump scares. Just got to go fast. They can't jump scare you. That's the way it's done. Oh, God, I just know they're going to. Oh, God, this is so scary. What if they kill us? Take the corner slow, Joe. You don't want to get caught out because you went too fast. That thing is probably waiting on you behind one of these doors, bro. This is wild. It's like the same hallway over and over with the same room. Bro, maybe the game is bugged, happened with the Yeti, and now it's happening with this, or we're just in a purgatory where we go in circles for eternity. Man, what do we do? You shut the fuck up and keep trudging along. Do you want to stay here? Nah, bro, I'm not staying in this hell. I'd much rather stay alive and get the hell out of here. You stay, that beast is probably going to eat you, or worse, have a political discussion with you. I'm just saying it's dark as fuck in here. I have a damn Hello Kitty flashlight that barely produces any light, and there's a monster that looks like Chuck Schumer running around. My heart rate is going up. You can hear it through the game. Oh, God, man, this is not it. Wait, what the? Do you know the person behind you? Oh, God, who is behind us? Now, nah, bro, you're tossed, man. There's got to be something happening here. What it is ain't exactly clear. Wait, what happened to the door behind you? Nah, bro, we're about to get shit on. Just great, man. Please tell me there's. Oh, God, no, of course there's. Ah. Holy hell, what the fuck was that? Oh my God. What was it, go back? I didn't see it. What was it, Obama Joe? What did y'all see? I heard the noise. I just didn't see what was happening. It was the thing from the start, that beast or whatever it was, the chocolate thing from SpongeBob. It charged us and now we're here. Where the heck is here though? Yeah, this don't look like a place you want to be. Looks like a Saw movie clip or something. Oh yeah, no shot Donald's fat self is fitting through those pipes. Well, Donald, you can tape out now. This is where you die. Why do I have to die? I'm younger than Joe. We already talked about this. We're going to let the young ones live longer because the older ones are closer to death anyway. Can I spin this? Oh, yeah, I guess we spin this and the gate opens probably. I mean, there's really nothing else to interact with other than that. Yep, I'm on the right track. There are times when all I can think about is murdering someone. Yeah, who the fuck is this guy, bro, straight up giving Dahmer vibes? We should call the feds. This dude is going to try and kill us. Not if we escape, we just got to go through the gate they have and we're cooking, then we can just come back with a machine gun or something and destroy the monster. Dude, this is exactly what the monster wants us to do. Can't your demented ass have some ability to see what we're doing is the weird game he has us playing? Dude's toying with us, we're dead, man, we're going to be dead. Okay, I've turned two of them, there's one left, and the we can continue. You need to chill, Obama. You're about as toxic as a reactor, like I didn't do anything to deserve your ass grilling my dementia. How about I grill your stupid self for stating obvious as remarks so you feel smart? If it was obvious, then why did you say just keep going? We're escaping, bro. There's only one way in and one way out. Bro's got the personality of Jigsaw and is straight up toying with our minds. That's valid, I guess. I wonder if we're going to escape. There might be a chance, but last time we tried to escape in the back rooms, well, it's just different rooms over and over to the point we go insane. Oh, holy fuck. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I don't want to play this anymore. Oh, my God, my heart. Oh, my God, I can't. Jesus, we. Oh, God. Shut up and keep going, Joe. We are not going to let this monster get the satisfaction of us losing our mind. We're going to kill him. I don't know how yet, but we're going to be the ones winning this. Well, if that's the case, he's already gotten the satisfaction. Because Joe lost his mind already, maybe not because of this game, but it did happen. What the? Why is that? Oh, my God. There's a monster above us. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Donald. Obama. Do you see that shit? Jesus, it looks like a spider. Nah, bro. I'm telling you, we're chopped cheddar. We're sliced and diced like the tomatoes the monster is going to use to eat us with. We're not surviving. Look at that thing that is terrifying. Bro, if we had a machine gun, we wouldn't have to worry about any monster. But nah. Let Holy fuck. Holy crap. Did you see that? Jesus, man. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Holy, that was terrifying. Oh my God, that scared me, Jesus, man. If it is a dream, it's fucking me up, man. This shit is scary. Are you kidding me? Look, guys, it's the monster again. The monster is trying to kill us, ah. Nah, it's all right, Joe. It's a monster that can't go through a chair. We're safe. He is taking pride in watching us suffer. We should stand our ground if it charges us again. Speak for yourself, I'm gonna hit the Debo Samuel and get the fuck out of here. Are you kidding me? The door is gone. Oh God, we're gonna die. Oh God, oh God. The door is right there. 
Oh, he shut it. The monster shut it. Keep going, Joe. He's behind you. He's probably chasing you right now. Shut up, Donald. He's not chasing me. He's not even behind me. He's just waiting on me to go back the other way unless he can teleport. Oh, God, what if he can teleport? Calm down, Joe. What is that clock noise? Is he counting down our deaths? Nah, it's just a clock. Wait, there's no door or anything. What's going to happen now? He's going to know where we are, bro. He knows where we are because the clock is so loud. Oh, my God, we're dead. I'm closing my eyes and just walking. I'm not going to see the jump scare. Joe, open your eyes, read the thing. Birds fly north in summer, east in spring, west in fall, and south in winter. Oh, wow, that's not hard. It correlates to the plates on the walls. Point one, north, east, west, and south. Bro, this is like the back room so much and demonologist. It reminds me of both the plot of back rooms and quality of demonologist. At least we can get through it without struggling like in back rooms where we had to cheat. Stop choking, Joe. Dang, it ain't that hard. Turn the plates and something will happen. Not that hard. Stop struggling with it like you struggle to talk. Shut up, bitch. You struggle to go on a diet. But at least when I talk, it's not putting me at a greater risk of dying. Oh, the cabinet moved like some Harry Potter shit man that's wild. Let's go, boys. All right, I made our session going to invite y'all boys. So, like, what's the objective here, Donald? I know you wanted to play this, and I kind of just bought it on a whim. So, like, we work for this company, and they want us to find scrap to meet Welcome a quota given by that company. Each scrap piece has different values, and ultimately our goal is just to constantly meet the quota. Otherwise, well, yeah, you can probably guess. I switched my name. New me you feel Mobamba is in the house, about to turn up on some kids. All right, we're in. This is hype. Okay, so, like, I think I remember how to get started. Whoa, Joe, you look actually young. You should probably fix that. Bro, this announcer guy is actually... Wait, hold up. This beat actually goes hard. What the heck, man? I didn't think it would hit this hard. Dang, bro, even got Donald hitting the jig like his ancestors did in the Civil War. Can't really do much until you get Obama in here. Man's taking 30 years for what? Acting like accepting an invite going to kill him or something. Bro, how is it my fault I have to mentally prepare myself for every session I take part in with y'all nerds? It's honestly to the point where if I don't do it, I'm just going to start losing brain cells. Well, lose brain cells, I don't give a shit. Just get on in here. I'm trying to run this. This game looks fun, but it also looks like a game I'd be playing at an arcade. About time, Obama Jesus. You would have thought you had to go to the store or something. You know, if you right-click, it highlights shit. There's a computer, holy bro. You think this got Minecraft on it. What if it's got, like, CS or something, bro? Come on, it has to have some game. Joe, stop messing with stuff before you accidentally launch us or something. You're going to screw something up. Just let me do it. Don't worry about messing with anything. Worry about being bait for the monsters. Oh, cool, a clipboard. Let's see what's on here. Service manual, service D's nuts in your mouth. Am I right, guys? God, I'm so fucking funny. All right, can we start this? I've only ever seen clips of it all happening. And it looks fun. I'm just trying to get my scare on and y'all holding it up. You're the one on the terminal, bro. Just figure it out. It ain't that hard. I mean, honestly, we could start right now. I just don't know how to... Reading this stuff, apparently there's like scanners and stuff we have to use. Maybe that's what the blue thing was when I right-clicked. Okay, first we have to select a moon we want to go to. As for which one, I don't really know what to tell you because I've never really played it. Any thoughts on this, Donald? I mean, we could really go to any of them. Which one of them doesn't have bad weather or fog? Usually that's the one we want to go to because less monsters, I think. Uh, this 221 is looking pretty fire. I think that's our best bet. Honestly, if we go to this one, it should be a good starting point, at least. No fog or bad weather. Bro Donald, how are you dancing, bro? Looking like you're hitting the gritty or something. It's actually insane, my boy. Oh, I found the button. Obama, look at us, we're dancing. Look, me and Donald on America's Got Talent. I can't start the game for some reason. Is it because I'm not host? Bro, can y'all stop doing shit and someone come and start the game? It's the liver at the end of the ship. Uh, let me check the terminal. Oh, shit, you said end of the ship. Uh, okay, I think I got it. Yep, we're good. Game started. Time to work our lives away, gents. Getting hunted by beasts we have yet to understand. All right, let's take it slow and focus on the objective at hand. We shouldn't do anything we think might cause us to die because then we get penalized for it. That means no dangerous tactics. Cannonball! Oh, shit, this is deep as a motherfucker. God, bro, someone should put some signs up. I thought you said the weather was clear, bro. Yeah, it was then you're cloudy with a chance of meatballs. Flint Lockwood self pulled up and it started raining. What kind of place is this? Giant ass pumpkins looking like it belongs to Hagrid on Harry Potter. Also, rip my boy Robbie Coltrane, never forgotten. Shy, if it's you remembering him, he probably wants to be forgotten. No one wants your dementia self remembering them because you're going to forget them in like two seconds. 
Bro, which way do we go? I'm about as lost as Helen Keller when she went into that haunted house. It's this way you got to hit the trailer and hit that D1 jump. Yes, sir. NFL combine ability right here. All right, be careful, guys. It looks like this shit wants to give away. And knowing Donald's fat ass, it probably will. Okay, cool. We got over it. Now what? We have nowhere else to go. We're about as lost as lost can be. But, like, why would they add that trailer? Fuck it, yeet! All right, so Donald just died. Man jumped right off into the water and probably sank harder than Jack did when Rose let go. Jump, bro. I didn't die. All right, so we're through like that. Dang, maybe Donald actually got a brain. Now we have to go to the main entrance still. Yeah, I think this is a dead end, honestly. Probably should have realized it was a dead end when you decided to go here. Donald, stop trying to climb a hill. Bro, it's this way, clearly. Clearly is a bit of a stretch, kid. I know you struggling and all, but you clearly didn't find it until I told you to jump. The fuck man Obama already found the entrance. You have got to be kidding me, man. You knew the way the whole time, yet you didn't want to help us at all. Nah, I waited here like a caregiver, like a mama bird waiting for her chicks to jump off the edge to see if they can fly. You learned a lot because I didn't help you. You can thank me, nerd. I'm going right, you go left, and Donald, you go somewhere. Oh, shit, bottles. Yo, guys, we got drinks. Beers on me, lads. Drop them at the door and keep looking, bro. Ain't no reason to get all hyped for nothing. Bet that's what you'd be telling Michelle when she tries to hype you up when you whip it out. Okay, did we check over here? I don't think we checked over here. We should probably check over here. Yo, I can't believe a company was like, let me hire some poor chaps just to go in with no f What the, yo, fuck, it's a turret, it's a turret, it's a turret. Run, 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 run the other way, run, oh my God. Holy, we almost died. Bro, it ain't gonna get better until we get through the first moon, bro. We ain't got the money to buy flashlights. So just make do with what we got. We're broke, my boy. Uh, I got a Coke can, I found a Coke can, I found a Coke can. Let's go, let's go, I found a Coke can, ha <laughs> ha. God, who invited this kid. Bro's tweaking on the tweak. Just hold it, Joe, and keep looking, bro. We're not even near quota yet. And we're probably only like 30% to it. I don't take the stairs, D1 hops. Let's go, you saw that man. I might sign myself up for sports next school year. Bro, Joe, you've been out of school so long, I doubt your teachers are still kicking. Hell, when you were in school, the Korean War was going on. And half of today's kids probably don't know what that is. Man, y'all said this was scary. There ain't no monsters, just a measly turret like this is some Among Us vibes. I swear, man, y'all best not have lied and made me waste some dinero on this shiznit. Joe, it takes time, man. You can't just magically get the monsters to come out, bro. They know you're here and want you to feel safe. That's when the strike and trust me. When they strike, it's like a JDAM carpet bombing from a B. 5-2. Bro, you mean a B-52, dang man, you can call strikes in, but you don't know what they're coming from. Joe, don't make that jump with your dementia. Oh my God, you're so lucky. Jesus, dude, don't do that, man. I thought you were gonna miss it. Did you see Drake May missing dimes on his receivers? You did not, therefore I do not miss. I only strive to be what he is, and so far it's going my way, honestly. I strive for you to stop taking up so much oxygen with y'all, that senseless yapping. God, it sounds like I'm talking to a drop shipping guy on TikTok. Bro, I swear there ain't nothing on this moon. Might as well be a foreclosed Toys R Us. You know it's not about the stuff we find, but the relationships we develop. We're going to be better friends surviving this, even if the monsters are too much of cowards to come out and fight Joey. Yep, he's going to be the first victim. Not a surprise there, prep for Kerry Obama. He doesn't got a clue what's about to be cooking. Joe, where are you even at? I swear, man wanders off like a kid in a Target who instantly goes to the toy aisle. I went to the end of this conveyor belt thing to see if they hid any goodies at the end of it. You know, some devs probably would hide stuff and all, so I had to check. Well, try to stay with that group, not trying to have some Scooby-Doo, where are you vibes going on, especially when you losing your mind in real life. Yeah, Joe, come back to us. We need to stay together that way. If a monster does try some shit, we will be ready. We will be extremely prepared for what is about to hit. Man, last time I heard that shit, it was people in Louisiana talking about how they're ready for Laura. You can't get ready for a hurricane, bro. It's just something that isn't possible. That's why you see me dip out every time one hits. Whoa, did y'all hear that? Sounding like there's some wall movement or something? Is there like forms in this? I swear, bro, it sounded like worms were in this, honestly. Bro, I don't know what to tell you, but it sure wasn't the ice cream man. There's things on this moon that even Donald might be scared of. Yo, what's up, boys? I was wondering where y'all went. Also, to address some of the comments from last video, we can't put our voices over the game while it happens. We're AI generated by software that reads transcripts. It's impossible in game. I know it sucks, and I will try to find a way around it, but just bear with me. 
Bro been screaming that to the American people every time they want him out of office. At what point do they just say, Oh shit, Donald, run, there's something in here. Run, Donald, run. Bro, there ain't nothing in there. Oh fuck, what Iger looking shit is that? Oh heck, no run, boys, run. Everyone evacuate. See, I knew something was up when it started Crip walking towards us, acting like it's moving on some Heelys. Bro looking like he was doing the moonwalk. You know, maybe we're misunderstanding them. What if they actually mean no harm? Or something, isn't this like racial profiling or something? I don't know, I just don't want to be accused of nothing. Feel free to go back in there and dab that little mongrel up. I'm fine with that, just bring the bottles back to the ship first so we can actually get compensated for your death. Are you sure this is the way back to the ship, Joe? Bro, are you leading me into some big ass puddle, bro? What are you doing, Joe? Obama, where are you, man? I need some help, Joe, leading me into the Marianas Trench. Dang, bro, just because it's deep don't mean you gotta keep sinking. Come on, man, get out of there. Get out of there, my boy, you can't survive. What are y'all doing? No shot. I leave y'all for like a second and you end up dying this quick. Like, come on, kids, what are y'all doing? I found a log and Donald died. I think, Obama, where do we go, man? I don't know what we can do other than join Donald with the Ocean Gate sub. Follow me, bro. You want to go D1. You follow the boy who's been there. Wait, we never got confirmation. Donald, did you die? Donald, are you still kicking or what, man? Yeah, bro, I made it back to the ship. Don't know what y'all were doing, but apparently getting through that water made it so I was right at the ship. Who would have thought? Dang, you could have let us know or something so we could go with you, but no, let me solo ride until I die. That's cool, man. That's cool. I'll remember that. Joe, we have to figure out a way around this water. I think we could climb this tower. Honestly, that might be a play. We climb this and cross it, and we should be back at the ship, I think. Fuck it, we ball. Yeah, you were right. We're right beside the ship now. Oh, look, it's Fat Boy McGee sitting right on top of it, acting all superior. Hey, fuck you, buddy, for leaving us back there. We could have died. You must be seeing stuff, bro, because I promise you I ain't outside. It's raining, and I just got these new boots, and I don't want them to look like they've been through hell in case I want to return them. Come on, Joe, climb up and put your stuff on the ship. Why aren't you climbing up, man? I can't climb the ladder, bro. I can't make that jump for some reason. I guess it's because of the water or something. Can y'all help me? Y'all can take it from me, and then I can climb the ladder. I told you we should have got that wheelchair ramp added in. I knew that would have been the best investment of our lives. Here I'm coming. Just hand it to me while you drop it so I can put it on the ship. So, like, how's this going to work? Are we just going to magically hand it off, or do I just have to, like, glitch it or something? I don't know. I ain't never done this. Just keep dropping it and eventually he'll pick it up from you. Don't overthink this old man, just use your common sense. Yeah, just find a spot and keep dropping it. I'll try to snag it while it's on the way to the ground. Don't worry, bro. This is a solid plan, like when we invaded Iraq. It's solid if it actually works. I mean, about time, Christ, I thought you were just kidding about snagging it. All right, shit, I think we're good, right? I think we have to be good. I'm pretty sure our launch happens at eight, no matter what, or that's like the curfew they have for us. If you're not back by then, it just launches. Something like that, it's around that time. Not really sure the exact one, but just let's be back before eight no matter what. I'm not trying to get left and then get that deduction. Well, let's get out of here, I guess. Launch this fucker into the stratosphere. I'm ready to start hanging out with Luke Skywalker again on the Death Star. Hanging out with Luke Skywalker on a base that is destroyed after Luke Skywalker died in the newest Star Wars? So many people gonna hate you for saying that it ain't even funny. Well, why don't I have any notes? Why does Donald get the most paranoid employee and Obama gets the laziest employee? Honestly, doing without that isn't the worst. These comments are kind of BM. We have two days left to meet the quota, which means we need like 100 more to get to actually where we need to go. No trolling, even though we really haven't been. It's just kind of beat. We haven't found stuff and the bug was straight diving us. Nothing a little shindig can't fix. Come on, Donald, join me and hit the gwitty. Joe, stop dancing. This is an actually serious situation. If we don't make quota, we're going to be victims of the company we work for. Now, I don't want that, and God knows you probably do, being you're going to croak in a second. Wait, Obama, what did you buy with our collective cash? You best not have bought some cheese or something, bro. I swear to God, if you bought something that is pointless, I'm going to be mad I found those bottles. Actually, I bought some flashlights so we don't have to wander around blind in these dark ass spaces. I can't help, I'm the only one who thought of this shit. Maybe use your brains for something other than looking at the pretty colors. I didn't get no flashlight. I don't know what you're yapping about, but I didn't get a flashlight unless Amazon one day shipping is slower than usual. I don't know what to tell you. Bro, it comes from the sky like a parachute gift in the Hunger Games. That's why we're gonna wait a bit and see when it comes. You got us all one, right, Obama? 
what kind of homie would I be if I only got you and me one? Then Joe has to wander around with his eyesight already half deteriorated. Hey man, my eyesight is in peak form. It's just I can't walk really well without problems because my posture is about the equivalent of Stephen Hawking. You said it, not me. I ain't say nothing to you and let it be known I didn't bring it up. Oh crap, it's a Christmas tree, yo. This is actually really cool, bro, the heck. No one take my flashlight, I want one. No one take two, I know y'all are gonna do some shit like that too. All right, once you get your flashlight, let's go in. We already wasted an hour on this flashlight, so we need to be quick. We'll not really just try to get in before the monsters start trying to cook. Honestly, I like these beats, but all right. Phew, focus up, Joe. You got this. You might die, but that's okay. You're ready for what's about to happen. Joe, don't go in solo, bro. You have to wait for us. You have to wait until we all get to the door so you don't start making the monsters active or some cheese. No shit, big fella. I need you all for bait so I can collect more stuff. Maybe I'll get a promotion. Although I don't think I need this side gig anymore. They don't even got benefits. Boohoo, shut up and keep looking for stuff. Watch out for what's in the shadows and shit, because if you don't, that's when you get killed. Nah, bro, do you guys hear that little girl saying, like, hi or something? Nah, man, I don't like this game anymore. I liked it, Demonologist. At least with that, we could just get jump scared. This thing is straight playing with my soul. Uh, oh my god, oh my god! What, Joe? Are you good? Joe, did you die or something? Joe, bro, are you fine? I found a Christmas present, bro. I found a Christmas present. Santa came early. I thought he didn't come this early, but let's go! We bagged a Christmas present. We like that. I wonder what it is. Don't open it. Joe, wait until we get back to the ship. It could be something big like metal, and you won't be able to carry it, so it's best to open it at the ship where you can take it less the distance and only in one slot. I ain't opening shit. It's my present, and I don't want to open it until Christmas. You're acting like those aren't the rules of Christmas, bro. I'm not risking my chance with Santa, so y'all can pull some O. Don't open it until we get back to the ship. That's a one-way ticket to the naughty list, bro. Bro, if Santa really was real, do you think he would deliver to your old ass? Like, think about it for a second. You think the man who delivers only to children is going to deliver some shit to the old, fugly-looking president? Shit he might deliver me from you, and then that's really all I can ask for. A wombo combo if he takes Bush with him. Make y'all his newest recruit elves. Well, can he do that after we get out of here? Apparently there's a radar that we're not using, and we should be using it. Bro, screw a radar. You hear all these noises? Nah, there's something lurking in the shadows, guys. We need to be diligent. Where did y'all go? I swear I just had y'all behind me, guys. Guys, where are you? I'm scared. Stop being scared, old man head ass. Just keep looking for stuff. We aren't gonna make quota if we don't step it up. And I'm not trying to face the repercussions of y'all not finding stuff. It's fine. I think we're gonna make it. It's only 1207 and we already have some stuff in the ship. I honestly think we're good at this point. Nah, I'm going back to the ship. Y'all have fun, Broski. I'm going to just drop off what I have and then come back for what's outside the front door. You better not open that present outside the ship. Use it inside so we can just sell whatever it is instantly. Bro, I don't even know how to open it. I'll just drop it off and let y'all open it if you want. I'm not risking it. What if it's a monster or something? That's a possibility, right? It's also a possibility that you're going to kill over in the next two years, but you don't see me rubbing it in. Just open the fucking present, bro. Why are you trying to act like it's going to be a monster? Bro, get off my case. You can open it if you want. It's in the ship. No reason for me to open it, especially if there's a chance I could get killed by a monster. Have some brain capacity to do something other than eat Big Macs. Bro, Donald just let him cook. He's not going to open it. Bro probably already left the ship. We're just going to open it when we get back, and then everything will be fine. I'm taking this engine back while you guys keep looking. The boss will be happy with me if he sees that I returned all this to the ship. Maybe I'll get a raise. You're not getting a raise, little bro. Your raise is the raising of your chromosome count, the raising of your old ass from bed after it took you 20 minutes to get up. Nah, you want to cook? Let's cook throw some hands with me. I might be 90, but I'll still make you see Jesus in a split second. Don't try me, bro. Your fat self couldn't even throw one punch without running out of breath or dying from a stroke. All right, kids, it's only 2 o'clock, and we're already trying to kill each other. Dial it back, and let's just keep looking. Now, bro, if the Oompa Loompa wants to dance, let's tango, brother. I'm fine with it. At least just trade him one for one or something. Come on, we can solve this in a second. All right, I'm just going to assume you're having a mental breakdown with your dementia. All right, Obama, let's leave and take everything back. I think we already made quota, so I'm not too worried about that. See, bro ran like a little biznatch. He's scared of the great Joey Biden. See, I told you I still got it. Muhammad Ali, who? What even is the quota we had to reach? Are you sure we're close to it? I'm really not interested in risking something that doesn't need to be risked. 
Shut up, bro. We made it. I'm pretty sure even if we didn't, we're going to be able to figure that out soon. We still have like one day left or something. I'm not too pressed. You haven't been pressed about anything since you took office. All that shit that goes on is handled by some other old man. You don't do shit but eat your cornflakes in the morning and stumble on your words like you stumble on sandbags. All right, you guys want to get the hornet's nest. We can get it and it's worth like 40 or something like that. Joe, go pick it up and run back to the ship. We're going to shut the door when you get in so the hornets don't kill you. That doesn't even look like a hornets. Wait, holy God, it's right here. All right, say less. We balling out like curry. Wait, do they? Oh my God, they're attacking. They're attacking, run Obama. God, this is the last time I ask you to do something. Fine, I'll handle this. Let daddy cook. He's going to be the reason we get this quota. All right, I'm going to shut the door so the hornets don't kill us all. How much is it worth again? It's worth like 60 or something, I thought. Saw it in a Markiplier video. Joe, can you shut up, man? This is some hard shit to do, and you breathing down my neck ain't helping the situation. Focus up and get ready. Oh, dang is going for it. Oh, dang, Donald, get ready to close the door. Run, Obama, run. You're going to die if you don't run, Obama. Bro, he knows he's going to die. Can you just shut up, Joe? This is some hard stuff to do, and you're just yapping when Obama is going through the ringer. What kind of delayed cheese were you all trying to pull? You didn't shut the door quick enough, and the hornets almost got in. Did you all want me to die? Like, come on, bro. Donald got in the way, man. He was trying to sabotage on my mama. Dude was out to assassinate you by letting you die to hornets. Of course the old dementia man is yapping, bro. Can you just stop trying to start an argument or something? Like, bro, we are making quota and everything is fine. Just stop acting like everything is a pissing contest. Wow, man, finally put his chins down and make a statement. Yeah, Joe, you need to relax a bit. We're doing good. Let's just not argue. This isn't Rocket League. Okay, we only need 30 more and then we make quota. So honestly, we can just run in and find something small and run back out. That might be the best option for us. Worst case, we can stockpile some extra stuff and then not sell it, like keep it for the next days of missions. And that way, if we don't make quota, we have some security. That's actually a big brain play, Donald. Didn't know you had one of those. Well, shit, I'm all for that. Let's just try to stockpile some stuff and then keep it for next quota. Well, this next moon has hostile creatures on it, apparently. So take it slow and be safe. Don't overstep or something. We've come too far to die here. Well, hurry up and land us, bro. We need to get a move on and see what we can do before the end of the day. If we do think it's too dangerous, we can always just not worry about stockpiling and just skip this moon. Now, fuck that, man. We ball out and stockpile. We're not skipping this moon. I don't care how much of a coward you are, Donald. We're cooking. I don't think it's more of him being a coward. I think it's more of he doesn't want to waste and risk what we have already by getting a deduction because we died. But I do think we should try. Well, when y'all grow a pair, follow me in. I'm not afraid of anything. And the fact that y'all were presidents at one point is insulting. No shot, Mr. Rogers is calling us cowards. Nah, man, we're not cowards. We're just using our brain power for something other than looking at pretty colors. Oh my God, Donald, you walked us into the water, you fucking idiot. You literally killed us both because you just walked into the water. Y'all really both died. You have got to be kidding me. Y'all thought I would die, but here y'all are sticking in the water like you're on the Titanic. Stop saying y'all, you southern shitter. You walked into the water first, Obama. I didn't do it. I just accidentally fell in after I tried to see if there was any way for you to get out. Either way, we both fucked up, so let's just move past it. How Joe is the only survivor is mind-boggling. Bro is powering up his breath just to get the words out. Wouldn't doubt the need for it being he's got the same amount of oxygen in the water that he does on land. You don't even know how bad I want to dive in and get the hornet's nest, but I refuse too. One of us is going to survive and that my friends will be me. God, shut up, Joe, and just launch. Get the ship back to the home base so we can turn all our shit in before you somehow have a heart attack and die. Then we just get fired and lose everything. Well, look at the bright side. We kind of both screwed up, but still have a chance to make quota, I believe, unless the boss is just having a bad day, in which case we're beat. At least I won't get fired. Wait, do I get fired if I didn't do anything wrong? I didn't die and y'all were the ones who died. So there has to be some, like, leniency with me, right? I did my job. We die as a team monkey, man. We're all going to get fired if one of us gets fired. Wait, oh my god, it only deducts from that planet, not our whole stockpile. That's actually so hype we might survive, boys. It's actually not a planet, it's a moon. You should know this, you orange baboon. Show some class and actually call it what it is. Well, we're about to find out if we survive or not. I best not be getting fired. Especially when I didn't drown in a freaking puddle like y'all apes. You can't really put that on us. We're not going to get fired. We fell in and can't help it happen now. We just got to move on and hope that what we had was enough to begin with.
Moment of truth, worst case we can feed Donald to the boss, he's got to be worth like 40 or something. Nah, Donald is 100% going to be worth something higher than 100. All that lard could power a lantern for years and years, not to mention all the meat that man probably has on him. Dude, death has a higher value. Okay, that is kind of sus the way you're saying it, Joe. Start putting the stuff on the deposit area so we can ring the bell. I'm not trying to hang out here when there's a chance we might not make quota. Bro, you gotta be getting some satellite interference with that toupee in your headset. We're gonna make quota, man. We already said that. Heck, we're probably gonna have leftover stuff. Yeah, Obama's right. You see all these big things we got? A freaking engine, for God's sake. Nah, bro, we're set, and I think we won't have to worry about it. And like Obama said, we can just give you up if we don't make it. Ring, ring, progresso head ass. Hurry up and take our haul. Donald, don't piss it off. Donald, you can't piss it off, man. What if it hears you and decides to take you instead? Then we're going to be down a man. All right, let's see what this paycheck is. Hopefully it's like 300-ish. Uh, let's goo. That's a good 395 right there. We can dip and go to the next moon. Good job, lads. And we still have the sign, which is worth like 30, so we have a good starting point for the next one. Just hopefully this one doesn't have some fucking puddles that you guys can drown in like you did on the last one. Hey, Obama walked right off that cliff and drowned. I tried to help, but was unable to. Really can't blame me for trying to be helpful when it was his blind ass self couldn't see a big cliff. You didn't try to help, you walked in with me acting like you were trying to do some Spider-Man saving MJ. Nah, you were just too stupid to realize you didn't have to follow me wherever I went. All right, shut up, y'all. Both stupid. New quota is 227. All right, that seems pretty free. You guys ready to go to the next moon? Hurry the shit up, Obama, your ass over there playing Minecraft or some Flash game on that shit. Come on, dude, just pick a moon. There's a lot more to this than just picking a moon orange ape. I'm trying to make sure we don't go to a moon that has a mother freaking giant or some big ass worm. I'm trying to pick one that we don't have a risk a lot. Of course the Dem tries to find the easiest way out. See if it were me picking. I'd pick the hardest one and make it my bitch. Then all the other moons would fear me. Oh, shut up with that prison mentality you got going on, Donald. You saw that in a Shawshank. Acting like that would apply here. How would the moons even communicate? I have one fat monster who can't run and one who can't walk. Do y'all think we can take on the hardest moon? Hell no, we're better off going to Hello Kitty Playland at Disney World. And even that might be beat. Wait, did Donald crash? Where is Donald? Obama, do you see Donald? Oh my God, this dude really is over here hitting the old shindig behind the cabinet. Ain't got nothing better to do when our commander on the terminal over there is about as quick as a Windows XP computer that uses dial-up. Hey man, that wasn't that slow. Sure it was slow compared to things we have now. But it wasn't that slow back then. Shit was like revolutionary. All right, I got our moon. It says this one should be that dangerous. But then again, the name of the game is Lethal Company. We're probably going to encounter some lethal beings. We already encountered Donald, who probably had a better chance of eating us than the actual monsters on the moons. I think we're going to be all right since we haven't been ate so far. First off, I bet if I ate you, it would taste like old pennies that you find at the bottom of your mom's purse. And if I ate Obama, well, I don't think I would eat Obama. I, I, is that a compliment or like an insult? Was that supposed to be targeted at me or was it just like a, oh, you wouldn't eat me because you like me? Yo, Donald, you think if I, uh, you know, he'd get mad? Vegas odds are looking pretty good for it. You hit me again, you old decrepit fuck, and I'll throw your hollow ass out the door. I have limited health, and if you continue to eat away at it, well, I'm going to eat away at what little chromosome count you have and use you as bait every second we're in this mission. Yeah, I told him not to do it, but lo and behold, the man couldn't help himself. You should probably keep considering him a threat. Oh, shut up, man. I heard you back him up. You know you were right beside me, right? God, man, you'd think you'd have a little bit of honesty with that toupee you got on. I mean, you've probably been humbled your whole life. Humble your lies, why don't you? Big Bird, this is Bravo 6. We're on the site of the next moon. We're moving in over. Bravo 6, kindly shut up. We don't care. Over. Call of Duty headass is always trying to reference the past because it takes them back to the age of when they were only in their 70s and not their 80s. Wait, Obama, did you buy us stuff? Did you buy the better flashlights? Is that why you took so long? Oh my God, you actually got us stuff, didn't you? Bro, are you kidding me? You had to say that out loud. Yes, I bought the better flashlights. I believe they should be coming from the tree thing. Let's go, these plastic ass flashlights are doo-doo dog water on my mother. Got me in a boogie kind of mood. 
Like honestly, I'm so happy we get better ones. We should turn some music on or something to celebrate. Hopefully they are better. God knows how much Obama spent on them. All right, I think the rocket is here. Yeah, it's back here. Come on, guys. I think they're supposed to be better, but there is always a chance they're the same, just with a longer distance. I'm surprised I actually lucked out and you didn't stiff me on one. Usually you would do some cheese like that. Wait, where is my flashlight? I don't see it. Is it glitched under the rocket or something? Obama, where is my flashlight? Oh yeah, about that. We kind of didn't have enough for everyone to get one. And you got beat to the only two we had, but hey, at least you still have one flashlight. You're probably better off with that one anyway. Dang, Obama really did you dirty like that. I wouldn't let that slide if I were you, Joe. I would, I don't know, piss in his cornflakes or take the batteries out of his flashlight. No, it's like that. That's fine. That's fine. I'm fine. I just can't wait until something happens and I'm needed. Oh, God. I'm going to make sure my flashlight and my will to help dies. Bro, it's just sacrifices you have to make. It's nothing personal. I just didn't tell you all about only getting two because it needed to be fair for all of us. I technically didn't make it, so you were the only one who didn't get one. Nah, you're good. You're fine, man. Don't worry about it. I'll live. The question is, will you... Oh, you done it now, Obama. Even I wouldn't stiff homie from a flashlight. You acting like you made it fair. But the only thing you made fair was that he would likely not have the reflexes to get it. You gave us an advantage, and you're going to get screwed over for it now, little bro. I'm not going to get screwed over because I actually know how to find the entrance while you both are wandering around like that one librarian from the back rooms who only attack when it heard stuff. Now nah, we're good. We're just taking the long way. We're going to find the entrance. We always do, man. We're just like that. I'd rather take the long way and find the safest route than go in as quickly as possible and have a chance of falling or getting attacked by a monster. Guess that's an excuse, but the logic ain't there. You want to take the long way to have a safer way when you could have just went. You know what? I'm not going to say it. I'll just watch TikToks while y'all handicapped selves find the way around. Imagine grinding this game out and bullying people for not knowing the ways to the entrance. Kind of funny, not going to lie. Catch me on Demonologist and you'll feel a different way. Get me on Demonologist and I'll still be able to cook, acting like I got the brain power of a dang Model T, just because you're old doesn't mean everyone around you is. Wake up, Joe. Your brain is overheating. Mm, can't wait to see that brother. I've seen more threats coming from a blind squirrel that thinks you stole his nuts. I ain't scared run it up no balls. Where did y'all go, bro? I'm absolutely lost in the sauce. Feel like I'm in the middle of a desert. I only found like a rusted out train. Big choice here, Obama. Do we just move on and forget everything regarding Donald? Or do we actually wait for the orange man? You know, it's gonna be hard to see him in the middle of all this sand, which is the same color as his skin. All I'm saying... I'll go find him. No reason for him to die in the middle of the desert when he can easily be saved by yours truly. Well, that... Ah, uh, holy shit. Holy worm thing. Nope, nope. Not trying to be a part of this. No, thank you, God. Nope, guys. It's beat there's monsters in this bitch. Probably just hallucinating again, old man. There shouldn't be a lot of monsters being Obama said it was a good moon, or was that the other one? Oh, God, did you pick a bad moon, Obama? If he didn't, I'll be surprised I saw some shit that looked like a cyclops and a cricket at the same time. I'm not trying to be in here alone, so I'm going to find something and run like a motherfucker. Yo, Obama, where did you go? I saw you for a second, and I lost track of where you were. You shouldn't be moving so fast, bro. You know, I got cankles. I went inside, you degenerate. I wasn't going to have you follow me like a freaking puppy this whole time. Monsters hear us, especially with your thunder thighs scrapping. Yeah, Bama, the turret is around the corner, so don't go that way. Just come in here. Oh, let's go. There's bottles in this shit. Man, I finally caught up with y'all kids. God, why y'all keep leaving me behind like I'm just disposable? Think about that, how toxic that is. We don't care about your sob story. Thanks for joining us and actually doing your job, bro, you know. It's easier to do stuff when we have all three teammates. Wait, is that a monster walking or is that Donald? What the shit? Run, guys. Run, guys. Run like we're running for our lives. I heard that stomping too. I honestly didn't think anything of it, but now I'm thinking it was a monster or something. Bro, this is not safe. There's freaking demons in this shit. Stop being a coward, guys. I have sign and don't test a boy when I say I'm gonna hit a bitch with it. I got a yield sign, so you Oh shit, never mind, never mind. Run, run, leave the base. Leave, bro, there's some big monster up in there, man. Holy God, there is no way we're surviving. Yep, I ain't going back in there, no thanks. Rather just stay out here and not get ate by a monster that I don't even know what it is. Go in there, Obama. You got that yield sign. You're the best fighter we have. You got this, bro. We believe in you. Don't worry if you die. We're going to get your body at least. If this is what the council decides, I will respect it. I'm going in this. Remember as I was not what I am to be. 
All right, all right, all right. We hear you. Hurry up and get in there and clap that beast, please. Trying to get as much stuff as we can. This is one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. Mm-hmm. Well, you ain't really. All right, I think he's finally in dying. You want to hit the gritty with me, Donald? Hell yeah, we like this. This is the type of stuff I strive for. We like this man. Wait, did you hear that? Yeah, Broski. There ain't no one in here hate to be that guy, but yeah, there ain't no monsters in this bitch. The hell there ain't I just heard Shrek do a roar up in there. No thanks, Broski, that's all you. Take that, you bitch, and that swing and a miss. Your mama don't look, I died, I died, guys, I, uh, I died. This calls for a return to the ship play. We need to get out of here, Joe, and return at least the bottles to the ship. Not trying to risk losing them. Ain't gotta tell me twice, you orange bitch. I'm gone, done dipped. Left 30,000 seconds ago. I hit the nose, actually, went Mach 9. I mean, we could go back in this hoe and actually see if we can get more, but I don't know if it's worth it or not. I don't think the bottles are gonna be enough for us to be fair. Yeah, I got assaulted by some, like, cricket thing, and, well, that didn't really go my way. Couldn't even pull the race card before he clapped me. Kidding. God, I know Donald was about to tweet that. Shut up. I'm going in. For queen and country. Oh, you, you're kidding me, right? I just died to, like, a blob blues clues stupid thing on the ground. Yeah, to be fair, I didn't see that one. Probably should have knew somehow. But, hey, welcome to the morgue, Joe. I'm club leader, and I'm actively seeking a treasurer. Fuck I will. I ain't helping your stupid club. Let Donald be the treasurer. I mean, he already makes a bag, and he'll invest the money wisely with his totally legitimate connections. You know, I hate how we have to do this in Discord, tired of hearing thing one and thing two backseat gaming, talking about some club they're in. No one invites y'all to clubs, just look at you. Be for real kids. Your mama invites us to her tea club all the time, not saying tea was drunk, but she invites us. Yeah, get burned, kid. That's a roast. You just got roasted like a, like a roast. Ha <laughs> ha. Top five things I wish I would have never heard. Take 25. I don't care, guys. We can die right here. I want to play demonologist anyway. My fantasy team won somehow, and I'm apparently lucky. You put Flacco and Cooper on, and they drop 20-plus games. Yeah, you're lucky. Not to mention the lining of the stars with a chain bros a leprechaun. I don't care. Can we just, like, leave this planet, guys? I want to at least run a tourney or something this week. We can hopefully get an SSL one if we keep winning. Wait, y'all hear that? Whoa, what is that? Donald, run. That is not friendly, not friendly. Run, run, Donald. Hit that gas and run. Oh, God, I'm going to hide for a second, see what it does. Holy fuck, it's right here, guys. Do you hear this bird thing? Oh, God, what creatures plague this world? Ones that are going to eat you if you don't run, Biggie Cheese. Get on up on the ship and run. Stop with this delay of game penalty shit. Get on the ship and leave. Hopefully the next moon will be easier if we do end up doing it. I just know, like, I wouldn't mind doing another moon, but, like, I know y'all struggling with y'all's autism, so, like, you gotta do something different every hour. Yeah, like, it's, like, totally crazy. Like, I couldn't believe it. Like, I really couldn't believe it. Like, man, I was so, like, surprised. God, you sound like a millennial tweeting. What do you expect? It's our voter base. Gotta relate to get the votes, man. Even you know that's how it works. Yeah, not gonna lie to you, Donnie. He's right on that one anyway. Y'all wanna run up some RL? Wait, we can run Rumble, imagine that. If we play Rumble. Nah, imagine SSL and Rumble. If we get SSL and Rumble and not anything else, nah, bro, we're fake. We need to retire from this game. We've been playing so long, hell, even pros look at us like, damn, those guys have no life.